Okay, welcome to the new studio. Well, to you it might look exactly the same, <laughs> but I've been working for weeks and I'd like to thank my friend Johan who helped me out a lot with this project. So this is the new shelves. I have moved everything to this wall by putting up four shelves. One, two, three, four. Before, it was like chaos. I had stuff everywhere, random shelves everywhere. And now it's all over there and it feels absolutely fantastic. It's not 100% in order yet, but I'm starting to label these boxes so I know where to go when I need to find something. I need to have specific cable. Okay, I go to the cable box. I go to the audio, office, props, live stream box, LEDs, cables, gaffa, and so on. If I need a camera, and often I do need a camera in this studio, then I have this orange shelf here, and I can just whoosh, let's go, let's shoot. No, it's a bit overkill maybe, but it looks kind of cool also. And then I have the charging station, it's over here. Before it was jammed up over there, I couldn't reach, it was a, like a mess. So now I have the charging station, V-mount batteries, Canon, Sony, Hasselblad, everything at that place, charging all the time. Down here, there's a lot of bags with uh, random stuff, grip and whatever. And over here, I have all the lenses mostly Canon lenses. I have the Hasselblad system, it's not here, it's in specific bag. Ugh. Pentax. <laughs> Who was it? Someone told me that these are extremely popular right now. The, the Pentax 672. So maybe I should sell this one. Yes, it was you, Oliver, yes? It was you who told me. They're very popular. We'll see. There's a lot of stuff I need to sell to get rid of, to clean up these shelves even more. I have a great FOBA, huge FOBA camera stand um, that I also need to sell because in my previous studio, it was a big studio and I shared it with three ladies. Shout out to Linda, Jenny and Anna. I realized that I need to have my own space because when you're doing these YouTube videos and you're doing photo shoots, you know, you, you have to leave the stuff and come back the next day. And when you're sharing a studio, you know, doesn't work. So this space is so much smaller, but nowadays it's mostly products I shoot, so it's fine. And uh, I can do whatever I want here, you know. I can leave the stuff and come back in the morning and finish. I also put up these pro boxes and I also have, let's see, so there is not so much crap lying around. I also put up the stuff up here, softboxes, uh, reflectors, beauty dish. And I think it will be the third year in a row now that I'm shooting my new Pegasus, Zoom Pegasus 40 Nike shoes. And we need to come up with a nice shot of these bad boys. So I want to wear them. I have this extremely dirty uh, Adidas, so I would love to put them on, but I cannot because then they will be destroyed. So you need to shoot them first. Remember when you're buying something new, shoot it for your portfolio. It, it's like the space became so much bigger, even though I just moved in, took away this uh, um, desk uh, desktop and move this in, I move these guys in and uh, soon there will be order here and the best thing 
one of the best things is that, you know, before I had a monitor, big monitor, the TV here, and when I roll this down, it's just covered, hopeless, cannot use it. So now we took that down and I moved it to that wall. This is the desk wall. <laughs> My little flower. Everything is cleaned up. And I have this big 50 inch monitor TV, LG. And it was hidden behind there. So now I can use this as a reference monitor when I'm filming the YouTube videos and also when I'm doing uh, the shoots. And over here, I have the stand corner. This is, you know, all the C stands, whatnot, you know. So this is where all that stuff will be. There we are. There we are. Here we have the whole studio. And it feels really big, but it's very small. It's like five times six meters, this place. Around 30 square meters, I think. Uh, but for me, it feels huge now, suddenly, when we did this update. And it feels really inspiring. I mean, I get a kick, I get a rush. Now everything is very clean and smooth and super nice. So hopefully, the next video will be the Nike shoes. We really need to come up with something very creative, something nice that will impress the viewers, you know? Something, something fun. I don't know what yet, but I will come up with something. Um, yes, that was the, the studio tour. If you have any questions, or if you'd like to buy a FOBA stand, very cheap, very good stuff. Uh, but I guess you need to live in Sweden probably in Stockholm to pick it up. Thanks for watching and as always I will see you next time.